Hi, I'm Sean Gannon and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about multiplying radical expressions. So if I was given this expression, negative 3 times the square root of 3 times 2 plus the square root of 6. Okay? Well, what I want to do is first look in the square root. Can I simplify anything in the square root? Or in the parentheses, sorry? No. Can't bring in anything combined there. So I'm going to distribute now this square root of three times uh, three, negative three times the square root of three to both parts. So negative three times two is a negative six, square root of three right there, right? Then we do it again, uh, plus the negative three stays on the outside, and under the square root, we just have the three times the six, okay? So now let's see if we can break this down. Well, six can break down to be three times two, and I see a pair, a pair of threes right there, right? So, once we simplify it, uh, negative 6 times square root of 3, I can't break that down anymore, so we have negative 6 square root of 3 here, plus negative 3 on the outside, times these pair of 3's come together, right? A pair, single on the outside, 3, and we're left with just the square root of 2 on the inside, we're the only single left. So you can simplify this, we have negative 6 square root of 3 just right there, plus, well, negative 3 times 3 is a negative 9, and so since it's a negative 9, we're just making a minus here. So minus a 9 times the square root of 2 is left over, and that's it. Our final answer here is it's negative 6 times the square root of 3 minus 9 times the square root of 2. So let's recap. We're given negative 3 times the square root of 3 times 2 plus the square root of 6. Okay. Well, we can distribute this, negative 3 square root of 3, to both parts. to give me negative 6 square root of 3 plus a negative 3 times the square root of 3 times 6. 6 broke down to be 3 times 2. Found a pair of threes right there, put the single on the outside. Okay? Then negative three times this, uh, three is just a negative nine, so we have a minus nine here, and then everything else is just brought down. So our final answer again is just negative six times the square root of three minus nine times the square root 